friends, it's Angelina Dima from Volcanic World. We are starting another day in Costa Brava, Spain. We spent a quiet night here in campground Palamos. We slept very well. Overall, it is a nice spacious campground with a good location that has sea views. Today we plan to do 15 kilometers along the coast, following GR92, because it goes close to the sea line. And we'll pass through the towns Palamos, Calonge, Plaja de Ro, and finally come to the San Feliu de Quixols, where we have our campground. We can see that there is practically no elevation change on the map today, so the trail is expecting to be quite easy, uh, but we'll see how it goes. Today we'll have one of the most town day, we think, because we'll pass through very few nature paths and a lot of sea fronts of the towns. So we're not really sure if it's going to be interesting and exciting, but we hope so. We hope that we'll find some, you know, interesting spots and something to focus on, maybe some architecture and stuff like that. So yeah, just a different day, very contrasting to the previous, very natural one. And we can see that today is another sunny day. Probably that's going to be very hot, so we'll better start early, <laughs> as early as we can. And yeah, let's hit the trail. From the start we got out to the amazing viewpoint of the sea and we got to see lots of people sailing which just waking up the urge of us to go sailing as well it just like looks so tempting and right now behind me you can see all our way practically for today going through these towns all the way there somewhere till the end so 15 kilometers here we go The trail is going very flat through these towns of Calonge, uh, going close to the seafront, but still quite boring, going close to the buildings. But then further down the trail we'll have a little 
chunk of the nature path. I think we can see like the greenery in front. So that would be nice. And yeah, the weather is sunny and hot today again. Starting to sweat, but yeah, hope for the fresh wind and some shade. We continue to follow along this Camino de Ronda coastal path going around these cliffs and little beaches which is really pretty and beautiful and we really appreciate this part. The weather got a bit more windy and on the sea there is a bit of waves like stormy waves but it looks really really beautiful to see the water crashing in the rocks so it is also great. And yeah, we had a bit of a lunch break now at the beach and also again we got to swim in the sea. We couldn't resist that because we got very hot and it refreshes us a lot. So with the burst of new energy we are good to go again and now we are coming to the Plaza de Rock town.
Right now, getting close to the campsite, going, still following Camille Ronda, going close to the coastline. And now we're going next to some kind of rock wall and something like looks like a fortified site or maybe a castle or some kind of, you know, ancient building, which we don't know the region of. If we know, we'll put it on the screen, like the name of it. But yeah, it just looks very pretty and, and it feels like we're walking through the castle and through the ancient constructions and like feels luxurious, you know? <laughs> Thanks a lot for watching, hope you enjoyed this hiking trip. If so, give this video a thumbs up and subscribe to our YouTube channel for more hiking adventures. Don't forget to hit the bell to stay notified about every new video. Visit our website walkingnatureworld.com to find detailed hike reports with pictures and maps. Hope you have a wonderful day and we'll see you very soon!